Hi, welcome back to the Four Woman Mamas. This is Joanne with Just Joanne. Um, there is a mommy tag going around. Actually, there's two mommy tags. The first version is from about a year ago, and version 2.0 that just came out um, by a fellow Four Woman Mama, Wing Yi, who's also on the Growing Wings. Um, she designed both of these tags. They're a series of 20 questions, and another Four Woman Mama um, just did version 2.0, Grace, on this channel. Um, so I figured I'd do the first one. So here we go. First question is, are you stay-at-home mom or a working mom? I'm a working mom, and I have been since um, my daughter was six months old. Um, would you have it any other way? I would love to be able to um, work part-time. I, if I, if I could afford that, since I'm a single mom, I can't, but once she starts school in September, she's starting kindergarten, ideally I'd love to have that nine to three work shift, but that's just not possible. Um, do you co-sleep? Yes, I do. I have co-slept since, uh, Juliana was probably just under a year old and she still sleeps in my bed now at five years old. Um, one must have gear for baby, uh, an exercise, not an exercise, a jumperoo. I, she had the little Einstein's, um, jumperoo and I swear that is the best one around. It's really brightly colored. It's all the primary colors. It has little hooks on each, um, uh, loop that goes over the actual jumperoo that you can hang little toys from. There's toys all around the actual seat that, that play and um, light up and play music and she can spin around and that was one of the best gifts I had gotten for her. Um, number five, how many kids do you plan on having? Um, I really don't have any kids in my kids planned right now um, since I'm sing a single mom. Um, I'd love to have one more but I don't know if that's going to happen. I don't, uh, it's all, you know, his plan up there, not mine. Um, date night. How many nights or days per month? I don't really have a date night per se because I'm single, but for my, me time, I go out twice a month when Juliana is with her father and she spends the weekend. It's a Saturday night to a Sunday, so Saturday nights I go out. Um, my child's favorite show. Right now, um, her favorite show has to be Full House. Yes, I know all you children of, like, the late 80s and early 90s, remember when that came out on TGIF on Channel 7? Yes, this is her favorite show, and it still plays on Nick at Night, so I DVR it, and she watches it regularly. So much so that she actually remembers some lines. Okay. So, the, number eight. Name one thing you bought before you had your baby that you never ended up using. A wipe warmer. Actually, it was given to me for a um, shower gift, and I never used it, so I returned it. It's a totally useless item. I, I mean, I'm sorry if any of you moms out there have used it before and, and think it's great. I had no use for it. It was just cumbersome and I had no place to put it on the changing table, so I just returned it. Um, child's favorite food. Um, chicken nuggets, french fries, and ketchup, and broccoli. That is her go-to dinner every single night. And my macaroni and cheese. She doesn't like the Kraft macaroni and cheese as much as she likes the macaroni and cheese that I make from scratch. How many cars does your family have? Well, I mean, if you consider my household, it's me, my mom, my sister, and Juliana, so we have three. Um, weight gain before pregnancy, during, after, and now. Um, yes to all of the above. <laughs> my, um, I am, I'm actually overweight for my height, and um, my weight fluctuates very easily. So I think my what I gained during my pregnancy because I got pregnant when I was I was still I was overweight weight when I got pregnant. So um, my weight gain was about 20, 25 pounds. I'm sorry, I have to touch something on my computer. Um, 
My weight gain was about 25 pounds, I believe, which is what my doctor wanted me, if, if any, that was the max that I could go. She didn't want me gaining any more than that. Um, dream vacation with my kiddos. Um, well, actually, we're going to be going on that vacation this year. Hopefully this summer we're going to Disney World. Yay! Um, dream vacation without my kiddos. I'm, I don't really, um, believe in going on vacation without my child. Um, just my opinion, I, I don't agree with it. I mean, if I didn't have any children, um, I would go to, like, I mean, even if I had her, I would go to Hawaii or Italy or something like that, something exotic or some somewhere out of the country. Um, or Hawaii really technically isn't out of the country, but whatever, you know what I mean. Um, has your life changed since your baby has been born? Um, yes, definitely. Um, in so many different ways. I mean, the obvious that I'm no longer married. Um, not that her being born had caused that. I think regardless of the fact that, um, we had a baby together, would, I don't think that our marriage would have worked anyway in the long run. But beyond the point. My, my life has changed very much so. Um, finish the sentence. It makes my heart melt to see my daughter play with her friends, with her cousins, um, just interact with kids and, and be so compassionate and so smart and so wonderful with people. She's just, she's such a, a giving little girl and it just, oh, it, it, I'm, I, I don't know. I can't say any, I can talk about her nonstop for hours and hours and hours. You would never shut me up. Um, where do you shop for for your kids? Um, I shop. I tend to shop um, for her clothes. I tend to go to um, Oshkosh. I've been really loving Oshkosh lately. Um, still, I can get a couple things here and there for Carter from Carter's, like leggings, and basic stuff. Um, and then I really love Gap. I know they're so expensive, but their clothes last a really long time. And they're very high quality. And I buy them a little bit bigger, so they're going to last her. I just actually bought her some stuff um, two weeks ago from Gap. Just two outfits. And I bought them in a size 6. And what I love about them is they're adjustable waist. So, yes, the pants may be a little bit long, but they're adjustable waist, so you can... Tighten them as much as you need, and they're long enough that they're going to get her through to next year. So that's what's really important. My favorite makeup and skincare products. Right now, for me, I use CeraVe skincare products, uh, the skincare product line, the face wash and the lotion. Um, I have really sensitive skin, so I use that um, with my Clarisonic, which I totally love. Um, and then my favorite makeup, really, I'm just using concealer and pressed powder. Right now, what I'm using is the Nearly Naked by Revlon pressed powder, and I'm really loving it. It just, it doesn't feel like I'm wearing any makeup. And for concealer, I'm using Lancome concealer. I forget, um, the name of it. Um, <laughs> Huggies diaper jeans, yay or nay? Um, well, Juliana was out of diapers when these came out, so... I didn't really have an option to buy them, but I, if I did have a child with diapers, I probably would say no. Um, you're probably paying extra for the jean, the jean look, and it's just going to get covered up anyway, so I didn't, I, I would never buy them. Um, number 19, have you always wanted kids? Yes, absolutely, 100%, I always wanted kids. Um... I hope to someday have more, but like I said before, it's just, it's, it's in God's hands right now. Um, the best part of being a mom, or best part about me being a mom, I, there's so many things that I just, I love about being a mom that I just couldn't list one. It's just that I brought this little person into this world and I'm shaping her into being a beautiful, strong, intelligent woman and 
the best part is hearing the things that I teach her. I mean, one of them, the first thing that comes to mind is the things, hearing the things that I teach her coming out of her mouth or seeing them in her actions or anything like that. I just, that's the best part, knowing that I'm, I'm teaching her and, and she, I don't know. I just I just love being a mom. That's it. I just love being mom. And she brightens my day. As crappy of a day as I can have, she makes it better. She just makes my life better. So that is my mommy tag version one. Um, if you like this, please be sure to give a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next video. Bye.